on-farm eradication of pigweed is possible. And that's because pigweed species do have weak points. Those weak points include short-term seed survivability and shallow germination. The first weakness of pigweed is short-term pigweed seed survivability. Research shows that after three years, less than 5% of that seed survives. And after four years, that pigweed seed bank will be nearly depleted if no other seeds enter. So the message here is, if you have a good weed control plan and don't allow pigweed to go to seed year after year, you could notice a dramatic drop in pigweed pressure on your farm over time. The other weakness of pigweed is shallow germination. Pigweed seed need to germinate in the top quarter to half inch of the topsoil. Research shows that burying pigweed seed below the germination zone with tillage reduces that seed viability. In a university study, Palmer amaranth seed lost 30% of its viability after six months of burial and 50% of its viability after one year of being buried. The take home message here is that the use of tillage can bury that pigweed seed and prevent them from ever germinating. The number one point to remember here is that pigweed are not invincible. A refreshed mindset and a willingness to try something new to exploit its weak points could be the difference between dealing with pigweed or eradicating it from your field. One pigweed left standing is just simply one too many. The seed it produces becomes a problem for you to deal with for years to come. However, Operation Weed Eradication and integrated pest management approaches can be a pathway toward on-farm eradication of pigweed. For more information about Operation Weed Eradication, contact your local BASF representative or visit operationweederadication.com.